Hey there, it's Vicky Marie, and today Roscoe and I are on our way out for our walk. It's not really a morning walk though because it's a little later in the day uh, because it's cooler now. <laughs> so we didn't feel like getting out in the cold. I didn't. He would probably have been fine with it, but we're going to get a later start for our morning walk. And yeah, I'll see you guys out in the park. Are you ready? Are you ready? It's Vicki Marie living life the best way I know how, and I know you are too. Roscoe and I are out in the park. You can see he got a little stubborn there and sat down. He just didn't want to go, so I took him off the leash. That's what he wanted. He just likes a few moments of freedom out there in the park, and I only do that when there are no other dogs or uh, kids around. So you can see the leaves are really, really changing, and look at all the leaves on the ground today. So it is definitely fall. I love capturing these changing trees. Uh, these are my friends. I do have a let it be tree, if you've ever heard of that. Um, when we used to go bike riding, there's one lonely little tree out in the prairie, and I, I talk to it every time we go by. So these are all now become my let it be tree. They bring me so much peace. And today there's a little bit of work going on. They're uh, clearing the leaves here in the park with their leaf blower. So um, I'm back from our walk. We are back from our walk. <laughs> and uh, it, was, it was a good walk. The leaves are falling now. I tried to capture some of the leaves on the ground. And yep, the leaves are falling. So we had uh, guys out in the park cleaning up the leaves. And so they had that leaf blower thing going and it was kind of loud. I am wearing my shirt. Let me stand up so you can see it. Hopefully you can see that. Is it cheat day yet? This shirt's really fun and yeah, the guy in the park said, hey, I need that shirt. And I said, yeah, I kind of need this shirt every day these days because I kind of feel like I've been cheating a lot. But it's all good, it's all good. Um, the brownies are now gone that I made. Um, here through October, I'm putting a video out every day. So you're gonna see about three decent sized vlog style videos, but the rest are going to be kind of shorter. So um, yeah, so I'm putting out a few little recipes and just sort of fill in fall kind of things um, like baking and and while I have a hiking one I did uh, when we were in Taylor Reservoir, we did a little hike so I threw together a little video for that and it was pretty short. So I'm doing that kind of stuff and I'm just, you know, this is all my theme for October is decluttering, cleaning and getting through, um, just getting through fall keeping my spirits up, staying on track with fitness, having a little fun, uh, and just being grateful, being so grateful. And so I wanna to talk to you guys about what I'm working on today, and that is, uh, I, I, I'm, I'm decluttering. I'm doing a lot of cleaning and decluttering and just building a foundation under me so that I can have some tracks to run on, as they say, right? Like we have to have routines in place to get through our days. And I just get, I've been really bad lately. I'm, I'm a rebel. So I went back to the Fly Lady system and I'm continuing to do the decluttering for 15 minutes every day. If you're not familiar with flylady.net, I will link that in my description, but she does a really great job of having systems and structures to help you in the homemaking uh, endeavor, which I'm, I'm a, a full-time homemaker right now, basically. I do work a little bit, but my main focus is now on homemaking, <laughs> especially now since we're all staying at home more. And I, my skills have gotten a bit rusty. <laughs> so I went to the flylady.net site and I'm gonna be doing this all through October and I looked at what the zones are she has zone cleanings so every week there's a different zone that you work on if you guys want to know more about zone cleaning uh, this quick little clip will hopefully help you <laughs> so I am going to be doing um, zone cleaning all through uh, October and I'm using the Fly Lady system uh, to get me started just because this is a really easy one. And so um, the way her system works is, uh, and you can go to flylady.net and just click on her current uh, fly zone uh, link and then scroll down. And this will show you, I need the big picture for the month. So this was September's. October's are going to be posted here in a day or so. But um, basically, this is the big picture. She breaks down the house into five different zones. 
And she says, don't worry if you think you have more than five zones in your house. We all do. Just follow the, her zones and you'll touch on every place in your home. And this I have definitely found to be true for my home. And so um, so beginning in now we just hit the end of September. So in this video, I did do uh, the end of September, the, end, the beginning of October. But you can see zone one is what you focus on the first through the fifth of the month. So it doesn't really matter, um, you know, 30, uh, September had 30 days, so it's going to be a little different. These numbers will change slightly for each month, but basically zone one, you're working on that the first five days or so of the month, and that's your entrance, front porch, and dining room. And then this, the 6th through the 12th, so about the second week, you'll be working on the kitchen through the pantry. And then zone three is the main bathroom and one extra room. So for me, that's probably going to be my studio, my extra bedroom. It used to be my daughter's bedroom. I'm going to be working on that around the third week of the month. Zone four is going to be the master bedroom and bath and closet. So holy cow, that's going to be a project. That's like the 20th through the 26th. So I'm going to be working on in that zone the fourth week. And then, um, and then the fifth zone is the living room in and family room and that's the 27th through the 30th and really that's my family room and I don't really I it's not a, I guess it is sort of a den but it's more of our office that's right off the family room that's what I count as that and the only thing this really doesn't hit is my gym because um, I do have a gym in the basement but that's like that's a whole different thing John has to help me with that anyway <laughs> so because that's just sort of a big thing kind of like the garage so um, so this is what I'm going to be focusing on in for Vlogtober. If you guys are interested, you can follow along and you know, I'm putting a video out every day in October. So, uh, since I'm participating in Vlogtober and they're going to be all different types of videos, but you will see me zone cleaning, um, all through this month. If you're interested in following the zones, I will, uh, have a playlist called clean with me. And you will see all of these videos in the Clean With Me playlist, and you can get started. So hopefully this helps you, and uh, it helps me as well to stay I have, uh, a on box track. from Amazon that came in. That's got to go to the garbage. I don't know what this is, but this is stuff that John uh, threw by the front door. I think it has something. I don't know what. I just don't know what it is. Uh, but he's getting ready to go hunting, so he's starting to, <laughs> he's got some things accumulating. I don't know, so that's just going to have to stay there. And then look at all the shoes. There are just two of us here, and look at all the shoes. I'm, I have my frother from the camper because I thought my frother broke, and it did not. The one that I use in my house, I thought it broke. It, uh, it turned out John just had to replace the batteries and sort of clean clean it up inside. He's, he told me as I'm cleaning it, I'm getting water um, inside, and he found some rust. Um, so he cleaned that all out for me and told me to be more careful. <laughs> aye, aye, sir. Now I draw from a number of systems to help me stay organized, but I do always go back to Fly Lady for stuff like this because it's just really, really good. Now what I do is I go to, uh, on our site, flylady.net, go to, to, uh, the launch pad, click on launch pad and click on sneak peek for the week. And you can look down and look at the the day and because i am filming this a couple days ahead i actually filmed this on wednesday but i was doing thursday's um mission so um so on thursday it says today you are to sweep your front porch around your front door shake out your welcome mats and wipe down your front door so i put a couple pairs of shoes back so uh we have a pair for each of us and this thing, I have no idea what it is. I stuck it in this box for John so he can do whatever he wants with that because I really just don't know what that is. And next, continuing into zone one here, I am just putting, uh, just decluttering, just going through and putting things away, straightening up. It doesn't look bad, but it's interesting. When John walked in the door at the end of uh, when he got off work, he said, wow, the house looks really nice. It surprised me because I really hadn't done that much. Just goes to show that it really does make a difference. And I know sometimes for me, I just feel like it's this is just routine, mundane stuff that really doesn't make a difference. So 
Yeah, it really does matter when, when those people give you those small compliments. It just makes you feel better. I do have my, my plant um, flower pots and stuff still sitting there, which that does, that's not very fall. I'm gonna have to change that out. So I haven't done that yet. And I've got my, my plants there. Uh, and that's pretty much the only house plants I have. So those all stay there. Um, I have my box of Kleenex and just a, a Colorado magazine there. And uh, it wasn't too bad. I did, I did have some newspapers I needed to uh, take care of. And just a little bit of junk mail. So, yep, this room is, the hot spots are handled in, in this area. Now, in my dining room area, you can see I have some hot spots. So I'm gonna handle these real quick. Now the Fly Lady has a new habit uh, that we develop every month and for October the focus is on paper clutter which is perfect. So our new habit in October is focusing on our paper clutter and so that means piles of newspaper, uh, it can be all kinds of things, baskets of unread magazines. I am reading off her website so go to flylady.net, uh, handling junk mail, boxes of old school papers, college papers, recipes, uh, tax papers, medical records. Um, I can do a whole separate video on this if you would like. Just let me know in the comments how much of this you want me to go into. Um, but yep, so that's really something that we are focusing on uh, the whole month of October um, is to develop healthy habits around paper clutter. You guys can see I have a little, a few things up here uh, that I've put on my china cabinet and my little uh, pumpkin, my jack-o'-lantern there. So I have started my fall decor, and right here, uh, I have a rubber band there. Um, but I've put a few pumpkins out, and my fall leaves, and my... I, I, that's what I got done as far as cleaning today. I'm just taking baby steps. I'm trying not to just get overwhelmed uh, with it, because honestly, I am like big time rebel, just, I am just a big time rebel. Uh, when it comes to getting housework done right now. So I'm just taking it slow and taking baby steps and I'm following the zones uh, in the Fly Lady system. Oh, well, this was the zone for this week. And uh, yeah, and this area wasn't too bad really. I had already pretty much cleaned out my china cabinet um, a while back and my, clo my coat closet isn't too bad. Probably could use a little work, uh, but I wasn't doing any heavy duty like decluttering. So I'm gonna to continue to declutter all in the month of October. I'm putting out a video every single day. And I think for dinner tonight, uh, we're gonna have uh, zucchini spirals and uh, maybe some mashed potatoes and grilled, che uh, grilled chicken leftover. So that's what's for dinner tonight, just really, really simple. And I got, I feel good, I got this done. I got a little bit of exercise in. It is not a workout, day. like I did, it's not a lifting day today. So uh, I got a little bit of my walk in. I might do some extra abs tonight um, after dinner or probably before dinner, but that's gonna be it. That's gonna be my day. <laughs> so nothing too exciting, but I hope that if you guys are you know, trying to get through your month of October and just get, little, get your cleaning done and, uh, that you know, maybe this will help you. I'm gonna be doing this all month and just giving you guys glimpses into my fitness, what I'm doing to stay in shape and what I'm doing to keep my house in shape. <laughs> all right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you are new to my channel, I hope that you will take a minute and uh, click that uh, subscribe button and click the notification bell and leave me a comment. I would love to hear what you're working on uh, this week and let me know how you guys stay motivated. Do you have any great resources to share with the rest of us? Let's just continue this conversation and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.